All right, how's it going? Uh, I am still pre getting prepared because I guess I just didn't get ready with all my shit today. Um, I don't know if you can hear me still, but I'm still working on the mic. So, you know, good stuff. And that's what it is. You know, some days you just are ready one minute in and some days it takes you 10 minutes to get ready. <clears throat> All right, PJ, how are you, man? Good to see you. Thanks for coming back. Uh. <sighs> All right, well, I'll do the, uh, set up the workout real quick before we get started. <clears throat> Alright. <clears throat> Excuse me. What is up, everybody? And today, go over this one. Today we're gonna do some more squats. And then deadlifts. I really like doing squats and deadlifts. If I had to pick, I would probably pick deadlifts, but they're both pretty fun. And I did go up on the weight. So that and that. I don't think I finished the shrugs last time. Back rows. I don't know what this is called, so. See how that looks. All right. Oh, still showing you guys the wrong thing. Uh, okay. Cool. Well, let me go grab some socks and then I'll come back. Sorry. I know I should have been better prepared. Beer beat. This time for real, uh, I got my shoes on already too, so I just put them on. Um, got 
guess that's it. We can get started. Took a long fucking time today. How's the music? A little quiet? Seems a little quiet. Lifting time. <clears throat> I heard that Ninja Turtles just came out with a movie. I don't know. I don't, I don't know how I feel about reboots like that. It looks like I could flip this around. I don't want to break it. I'm a little worried about that. All right, fuck it, good enough. All right. You're saying Ninja Turtles has been rebooted so many times? True. But I heard it just came out with a new movie, so who knows? Welcome back, PJ. I'm also back. You missed me just kind of fucking around. Yeah. <sighs> Um, so we're doing squats, squats. Uh, PJ, I remember you were saying you were gonna hit your PR yesterday. Did you get it done or your new PR? You hit 210 on the bench? Hell yeah. Five miles seems like a good distance for a run. 15, I think, which was pretty good. That was my PR for bench. You're still dead? Dude, I don't know. I mean, I feel like running in general is uh, just like a way to drain all your energy. Are you ready?
Nice. I think arm day is my favorite. It's always nice to work out the pretty muscles. And that walk seems like a pretty good distance. Oh, I was going out with the dog to uh, walk for a couple days and then I was just really tired so I haven't done it in a bit. Ooh. Tomorrow's your rest day? Nice. I think rest days are super important too. It's one of those like, you know, feels like you should be working out but it's better to just actually work out. I mean better to rest and let your body recover. Um, <laughs> Four miles back and forth, damn. Or one way, no, sorry. Yeah, four miles back and forth or four miles each way. See the way, that's a lot. I'm gonna put one more plate on these. Ugh. I feel like that last one was slightly not heavy enough. Come to me. Oh. It's two miles each way, okay, that's cool. You walk everywhere? Ah. Your lower back hasn't been hurting as much, that's pretty good. But I think the weak muscle is just like a symptom of probably sitting too much. be squatting soon. I think doing the motion with no weight is probably good to start working on those stabilizers. Um, <clears throat> as far as like the walking everywhere, I remember you live in Bulgaria. Now I'm assuming it's more walkable than like Texas is because Texas you have to have a car, everything's 30 miles away. <clears throat> Like I could walk <clears throat> like four miles that way and I would probably see like 
There's cornfields <laughs> for the whole walk. A couple houses and then cornfields. I may have miscounted that one, but I don't know. <clears throat> cool. Oh. Doing that one actually feels a lot like it's in my forearms more than my back. <sighs> Hang on, I'm coming back. Trying to decide if I hate those fives enough to not, to just go to 45s. I think we could do 225 on a squat. Let's give it a try. Excuse me. All right, hold on, let me get a look at this. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, I do the same thing as far as like activities, like pretty much do all the outside stuff all at once or all the workouts and then just go back to sitting. <laughs> so pretty, pretty standard I think. All right. It's 225 for six.
Nice. That didn't feel super heavy. Uh. Yeah. Ooh. I had 12 in me. I mean, I probably had eight in me. I don't know about 12. Remember PJ, it's all about small incremental gains for me, you know? Don't need to be like a bodybuilder in the way that like, I think we think about them in like the Mr. Olympias. I want to be strong enough to like pick myself up from the emotional pit of despair. Uh, all right, I'll try to do like more on this one. I'm already going up in weight. What else do you want from me? More reps? <sighs> Get out. If you're talking about the back rows, I can do 12 of those for sure. the squats fuck that's what I thought you were talking about Heavy said I could do 12. I don't know, man. I mean, maybe on the first one.
I'm trying to think. I mean, I was basically doing only 50 pounds less than this on my last warm up. I did 24 reps all together, and then this one will be 18 reps, and that's 42. I don't remember that. 24 plus 16, so what, 40 reps? No, plus 18. Uh, 42. Yeah, that's how math works. I did it right the first time. So that's 42 reps. And 18 of those are the heavies. And then the other ones are still pretty heavy. I don't know. But also, last time you were talking about like the mental game, you know? And I think that not having a spotter or anybody in here is something that keeps me from going too heavy or pushing my limits. And that's just a sad fact. All right, there was eight. It's like my arms are running out of blood. Whew. Whew. Hey yeah. Yeah, I think the spotter part is really the big key. <sighs> Holy shit. Whew. I will say that my buddy who lives close by could be my spotter. There's just not a shitload of room in here, so it gets really cramped really quickly. And he's a big dude, so, you know? Oh, I was like, what changed over there? The ad break thing went away. But yeah, so, I mean, if I had a spotter, that'd be one thing, but we gotta go with the tools that we have. I think this means I gotta go to 225 on my deadlift now.
I'm gonna do the ring rows again. Those were an interesting excursion. <clears throat> Not today. Um. I guess I can put this back here. I want to use the bar for rows. Um, I think it's just because I'm trying to optimize time. So, like I can do squats and rows together and then I don't have to do them separate. And then like here, I can do back rows on that, those ring kind of things, I think. And then I don't have to do a whole nother set of back. I think that's pretty much the only logic behind it. But yeah, the, uh, the, uh, I keep talking about it every stream and then I get off the stream and I don't think about it for a while. But like, I just gotta order those other dumbbells. Cause that's really what I'm kind of like waiting for. By waiting for, I mean, that's what I need. But I'm just kind of being lazy, if you know what I mean. So,
PJ, I can't believe how involved in my workout you are. It's just so surprising. I guess that's kind of what I expected when I started streaming, but no, I just know that thought nobody would care. Five fifty. Forgot to tell time. Is training without music worse? Um, I don't know. <laughs> For me, normally, like I've always listened to music working out or audiobooks or something, so. Just kind of sticking with that trend. You care about training, I mean, that's good, right? I think that's, you know, the right thing to care about, especially not getting hurt again. That's a big one for me on my list of don'ts. Don't get hurt again. Don't lift too heavy and get hurt again. Don't, you know, ego lift and get hurt again. Don't do too much and get hurt again. Pretty much my goals. Let's do this next one. Uh. <clears throat> You ego lift? Yeah. I think everybody's guilty of that.
partials and swinging a bit. That sounds like a good recipe for getting hurt, which as you might know, I'm opposed to. I see. I mean, that makes sense. As long as you're doing it cognizant, you're aware that you're doing it, that helps you probably not get hurt. <sighs> this bar just lots, likes to move on its own. Uh. 
Pada suck. I mean, I can definitely do lat raises, more lat raises without hurting myself because they're just dumbbells. You can't even see me. I thought this camera could actually see the floor before, but I guess it can't. <sighs> Holy smokes, that one took it out of me. I definitely think that the form is more important than the weight. And then I think that doing any workout is better than no workout. That's just my opinion. God, I wish I could stop wiping all this sweat into my nose. Hooks are a thousand percent in the way. <sighs> so hard to use when I'm not lifting. Just need to put the weights on. Fuck. <clears throat> Guess we're just snorting, snorting some fucking sweat. It's the good stuff.
Hmm, I see what you're saying. I mean, you're mostly about using all your power and energy every time. And I get that. Oh. Oh. It's just different styles because of our different goals. But I mean, you're like 15, so you got, you got a lot more motivation to uh, want to like get stronger faster I think than I do you know like I'm not really like I don't have to go to school or go find a new girlfriend or anything like that so I don't know I'm just kind of in like pseudo maintenance mode with weightlifting as the maintenance and like 225 what I'm at right now on the bar this is kind of my goal like this is kind of where I was thinking about like getting my lift to and then staying at this weight for all of my three exercises. I don't know if that's what I'll do, but that was kind of the original plan. So, I don't know. But yeah, that's kind of what I've been thinking about. So what do I do after this? Just focus on cardio all the time and just do my big lifts whenever, like, and just keep it here? I feel like at that point, I'm basically just doing muscles, muscle cardio. But, I don't know, I'm definitely seeing the physical improvements that I was hoping for. You know, that's always good too. I'm trying to keep talking so I don't have to do this set. Oh. Hey, I mean, I was going this way. See me over there, can you? That was a bad one. That was a bad one.
fuck. Holy cow, I'm fucking wrecked today. We're gonna chill for a second. Even though I've already been chilling for like a minute. Oh. <sighs> Did the full stack on the triceps? Holy smokes, dude. That's usually what, like 180, 200 pounds? Something like that? have a weak core I mean you used to have weak biceps and chest and look at you now I think having a core that's weak it just gives you something to focus on it's like the same reason I try to do those glute bridges after I do deadlifts and squats like they are awkward to do I don't like doing them on stream especially with other people watching and then the whole motion is awkward too. So uh, yeah, but I gotta do it because that's, what's all, that's what will help your back, at least for me. Whew. Wow. All right, I'm gonna do the last set. Oh, butt sweat. Look at that butt print.
I can feel like a little bit of a pressure headache right here. Nope. Hang on, I gotta sit some more. Oh. 300 pounds with a half reduction? What does that mean? Does that mean it's 150 pounds? Oh. All right, I'm gonna try to finish it. Whew. All right, hopefully I don't blow a fucking vessel in my forehead. Back to the chair. Just what I needed to not. Fuck. Ah. Uh. Wow, I am just hot dog water today.
Whew. All right. Ad break in 40 seconds. Holy shit. I feel like the ads go off so often. Okay, let's rack, rack it up. Oh, I don't give a shit about the ad revenue, bro. I mean, each ad is like a fraction, a fraction of a penny. I would rather you guys get to hang out and chat than have ads. But unless they change something recently, pretty sure they're mandatory. So, you know, it is what it is, but I'm glad that the ad blocker works. I also don't get ads on Twitch because I have an ad blocker as well. Whew. All right. I got a wicked headache coming on because of these lifts. Oh, come here. I pushed way too hard on that. Uh, uh. All right, hold on. Oh, okay. I was gonna stretch and do some bike, but I think I'm gonna go put an ice pack on my forehead. Oh, we're gonna do our journals. The journals. All right. Um, today is Wednesday. Um, it's like I just always read it. Squats, uh, back rows, deadlifts, uh, shrugs. Ring rose. All right, well, we went up even more than I thought, or like I thought we would. Um, did, no, it was 65, 65, and then, yeah, 90, which was 225. We did that, nice. Uh, 20. Deadlifts, we struggled a bit. Very hard. Um, shrugs, did a few of those. Ring rows, did a few of those. All right, well. Yeah, it's okay. Sometimes when I like when I'm pushing in the lift, I'm like, Aah! 
it's, I just like right here, I don't know how to describe it, like right there. I can just feel, I don't know, like a little something. So anyways, um, it's okay. I'm just gonna go chill out for a bit. I hope, uh, PJ, I hope you have a good workout uh, in two days. I know you said you're gonna rest tomorrow. Um, I'll see you, uh, I'll be here tomorrow for a bench stream, just like normal. And then, yeah, all right, catch you guys later. PJ, take it easy. <clears throat> oh, don't push too hard and give yourself a headache. This is one of those times where I wish I had like an ice bath, I think. All right, catch you later.